what I like about astronomy is is just the sheer wonder of, of what's up there. Um, I grew up in dark sky locations where there's no street lights around or anything like that and, and just to be able to go out when I was a, a child and look up and, and see all that stuff that was going on there and, and the curiosity um, just just grew over the years. Our company was started in 1910 as a blacksmith company went on to a welding company doing industrial commercial products then got involved with doing uh, telescopes actually built two telescopes. Uh, we have built about seven enclosures that house the telescopes and the last telescope that we built was the Keck telescope which is still the world's largest telescope and our present telescope of course is the TMT which will be the world's largest telescope. The TMT is, is the 30 meter telescope. Uh, the largest telescope in the world right now is 10, 10 meters. Clearly much larger than anything else ever, ever built and it's quite a task. The enclosure weighs around 2,000 tons and so does the telescope structure. The structure itself stands about 14 stories high. It is a very, very large structure. So it is very important that we have this uh, third dimension in order to understand the level of detail that we have to understand, especially in complex structures. The telescope and the enclosure together, um, I'm expecting that we'll have the order of 200,000 parts in the inventor model that we're, we're building. One of the biggest advantages, of course, is then once it's built, then how do we maintain it? These are the types of things that without the software, I'm not exactly sure how we'd do it. The manpower would be overwhelming. The software automatically keeps track of all those hundreds of thousands of parts for me. It keeps count for me. How many times have I used that size steel beam? How much do I need to order? It helps me with that. Nobody's ever gone where we're going with this model. It's groundbreaking for the software as well as for our design. Good design is really understanding what the end goal is. The uh, ability that we have today to really prematurely visualize what we're going to build has got significant advantage. Astronomers that we work with, they don't know what a drawing is. They don't really understand how a drawing works, how it's communicating its information. The fact that we can take a part of the model and we can we can spin that around so they can see it from different angles. They can see the clearance of what's around it. They can see how their instrument is going to relate to the telescope. The TMT will be all conceptual, all design, and, and it will all be done with modeling. The fact that we can do this digital prototyping means we don't have to spend all those tens of thousands of dollars to make the real thing and then find out that it doesn't have the effect that we want it to have. The majority of the work we do is working with the clients to turn their dream into reality. And that's certainly true as far as the telescope work is concerned. Good design improves mankind. The, the good design um, allows us to go forward. And, and I always like to think for, for the betterment.